you here for another motherfucking story time. Yep, episode two already. Same same outfit as what I had on in the first one because yeah, I'm not. It's not even an outfit, nigga. I just put on a jacket and a beanie with a bandana over it. On my Tyrone shit, how you put a bandana over a do rag? Yeah, but um, oh, it's a real story right here. Um, about when I was chilling with my ex and how I felt about the situation. We were just like, um, like warning. This is for people who are a little bit more mature, aka probably preteen and up. Now, if you're not a preteen and and up, I don't give a fuck if you're watching this. Me, nigga, that's your parents' fault. If they don't want you watching shit about talking about nasty, not nasty, nasty, but like, like teenager type shit, then oh well, nigga, I don't give no fucks. Um, uh, I ain't gonna say her name because, you know, I don't wanna, I don't want none of her family members to somehow see this because I don't, my videos are not, my YouTube channel is not popular, so it's not a big chance of them seeing it, but. A lot of people in Hanford be like, "Oh, I I looked up your, I looked up Hanford fights and seen your YouTube channel." So there is a chance that they seen the Hanford fight video and then went on the channel and seen if there was other fights or other videos and they seen a new one and they're like, "Oh, what is this? Oh shit, that's my cousin or that's my niece or a little kid like, hey, that's my auntie." Like, yeah, we're not. We're still high schoolers, sophomores. Yep, out here, nigga. Yeah, squat. But back to the show. Oh yeah, I got my beard. I don't, I don't think y'all can see it, but a little. If I never shave it, like it'll be like I have Rick Ross beard and shit. Probably I don't know. But back to the story, nigga. We was just playing with each other on there, like you know how. That's like, you know how you do with your, like, girl, you be kissing all up on her, or filling up, we just kissing and touching and cuddling and shit, and then, like, I was playing with her titties and shit, you know, um, and then, I, I kind of don't want to post this video, because, you know, like, some of my family members, who, like, found my channel somehow, I don't. I don't be telling people. I don't be telling my family members about my YouTube channel because you know, I, I talk about inappropriate shit. You know, and my peers they don't give a fuck because they go through this shit all the time, man. More than me, most most of the time. Most of them, no. Sixty percent of them, yeah, most of them. Sixty percent of them go through the shit I'm talking about more than me. Like, I talk about gangster shit and. I'm not no gangster nigga. I'm around gangsters and shit, but me, I'm just a real nigga. And niggas get pussy more than me and shit, so yeah. But yeah, I still. Yeah, you know what I mean. But straight up, man, let's get back to the story. Yeah, I was playing with her titties and shit. And like, I was, I was like, I, we was not together that long at this time. I was like, Hey, let me see, you feel? Playing with, I'm playing with him, so you might as well let me see him. She all shy and she like, I don't want to. I don't, I don't, like, come on. Stop. If you, if you my girl, don't be shy around me. Why the fuck you so insecure? Like, okay. If, if you got a, a, a girlfriend, um, niggas. Show them whatever the fuck you want to show them. Don't be insecure. And girls, too. Show your boyfriend your body. Like, unless they finna, like, unless they the type of nigga that I take a picture and tell her the whole fucking school. And recently, there was a girl who got caught sucking dick. And, yeah. At East and shit. I'm, I, I go to West, though. I go to, I go to that West. But, yeah, I should got around. I, I kind of want to know what the fuck happened to her at home. Like, because she got expelled. Yeah, I was at school. The Amber Quarter. She was just <laughs> and the nigga like in the back took the picture. And like Hey. That nigga had a condom, cuz. 
<laughs> you get in the head with a condom, my nigga. Back to the story though. Back to the story. She all she all shy and shit. She on top of me, like and like. All right, the picture that she was like when she showed me, she was like then covering him back up. Well, she she had a shirt, so like she went like well, I had button up, but like picture like this in my shirt, and she lifted him up. I seen, yeah, I got to see them titties on her nipples and shit. Even though right there when I did, it, you couldn't see my nipple, but that's not the point. That's besides the point. Like, why the fuck you you scared to show me your titties? Like, what sense does that make? I'm your nigga. But, um, moral of the story, stop being shy around your people. Like, that goes for everything. Like, if you my family member, I could walk around a house with no fucking shirt. I'm your fucking family member, so I don't give a fuck. And I'm not talking about if you're a girl, because if you're a girl, it's different. Y'all got titties. So, but as a nigga, you could do that. I could walk around with my motherfucking draws, which I do. I give a fuck what family member is here. I'll walk around this bitch in my draws, nigga. But just. That was just real story. Real trap shit. And if anybody ever been through some shit like that, please. I'm, I'm telling y'all. Make a video on that. Tag me in the shit. Something, my nigga. I, I want to know. Y'all struggles. Because I'm. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna be telling y'all my struggles, you. It's not gonna get that many views, I know. But I'm just gonna tell y'all my struggles because you gotta talk shit out to get it off your chest. The shit that's on your mind, if you don't let it out, it's gonna just be there forever. Forever, ever. And ever, 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 ever. Damn, this. Okay, I'm gonna stop this video again too long. Peace, like, subscribe, share the video. Thank you. I love y'all. Deuces.